Hi everyone and welcome to my October 2023 setup. So today I'm going to set up my cover page and my quote page. My theme for this month is going to be Barbie because it's pink. October and pink October is for breast cancer awareness. And I'm combining this theme with wild journaling, which is a big one from Oops A Daisy UK. So it's going to be leopard print, pink and yeah, body quotes. So to start, I'm using uh, under the Rowan trees stencil that I got last year when I was an, an Rowan Berry Box ambassador. So I'm blending pink. This is Kitsch Flamingo and this one I remember. Tea dye, I think it's, it is. So yes, tea dye and gathered twigs from Tim Holtz. So as you can see, I'm using two different brushes to blend the inks. And I'm going over <clears throat> the first layer and then I'm adding. It's just layering, but yeah, it creates a soft blend. And then I'm going to add this little gunk sticker from Oopsa Daisy. She's everything, because every woman is everything. Then I'm using the VIP She's Everything stencils to letter the word October. And I'm using twin tones because they have two ends. It's a small nib and a little bit bigger nib on the other side. And I love these because they work with font stencils and they work for coloring. So now I'm just kind of filling in every letter and going around to create a shade. And now I'm going to add some washi, but I, yeah, I wanted to add pink washi and the leopard print washi to this. And as you can see, while I'm setting up the washi, I remember that I haven't set up the second page yet.
So I'm leaving the washi in the middle of my page before sticking it to the page because I need to do the same blend that I did to the first page to my second page. And now I can stick it in. And for some balance, I'm sticking some washi on the top too. And these are actually highlighting washi. I'm using these when I highlight in books usually, but it works well for this thing. So now I just need to add my calendar tab. These are from Oopsa Daisy UK too, and I love these because they create some little... You get the tab and you get the calendar, but most importantly the calendar starts at a Monday, not on a Sunday. Then I just need to cut the washi that are on the edges to keep it neat. Here's where I remember that I haven't closed my little ink boxes yet. And that's important because otherwise they dry. And now I'm going to use the stencils again, but before I'm just writing out the words that I want to write in brush lettering and then I'm just quickly scribbling down the words that I want to be in the font stencils so that I know how many letters there are in the word so that I know which one should be in the middle. That way I'm spacing out the words in a better way. So this took a while actually because I wanted everything to be neat and nice, so I have just sped it up a bit. I then realized that you can't see the world correctly, so I'm going to fill them out. I'm speeding this up too because watching somebody color in words isn't fun. Here's my cover page. So as you can see the sticker is holographic. Thank you for watching.